Ready to go? In St. John's, the mayor himself raised the rainbow pride flag outside his city hall in solidarity with Russia's LGBT community. And as a sign of our support for human rights and the rights of all individuals. The same rainbow went up at city halls in Edmonton, Ottawa, Montreal, Halifax and others, even at the provincial legislatures of Manitoba and Newfoundland and Labrador. It went up at Toronto City Hall as well at the request of a local community group. But when Mayor Rob Ford saw it, he ordered city officials to take it down, replace it with a Canadian flag. This is about Olympics. This is about being patriot to your, patriotic to your country. This is not about someone's sexual preference. Only problem, Toronto's protocol officer is the only one who decides what flags fly from the City Hall courtesy flagpole. That pole hosts all kinds of flags during the year, for Autism Week, Fair Trade, to honour the national days of dozens of countries, Brazil, Azerbaijan and Israel, for example. There's also no shortage of Canadian flags flying full-time outside City Hall. Ford's flag flap led Toronto's only openly gay city councillor to, for the first time in public, describe the mayor using these words. Um, you know, I think he's clearly demonstrating that he is homophobic, that he is bigoted. Earlier this week, Ford took some heat for these comments. I'm not going to go to Pride Parade. That's, um, I've never gone to a Pride Parade. So I'm not going to change the ways I am. His brother, city councillor Doug Ford, says that does not make him homophobic. He's not homophobic. He has uh, friends that are gay. The rainbow flag stayed. In the end, Ford put up his own maple leaf, dorm room style, in the window of his office. Ron Charles, CBC News, Toronto.